Hi everyone, today we're going to do a nursery tour of our little baby, a uh, boy that's soon to be almost five weeks from now. So we got the nursery ready to go. Yeah. Are you excited? Yeah. Are you happy with it? Yeah, I think so. I mean, it's it's complete. Yeah, <laughs> it took a while. Yeah. So let's get on with the tour. So as you first come in, to the right side, right above his light switch, we got Welcome to My Crib, and we have this little Winnie the Pooh, um, portrait and we've had it for many years and it's been ours and now we're passing it in, on to his room. Also on the door for now we have arriving March 22nd mm, yeah. March or in March 2022. Um, and then this is also a safe sleep um, just doorknob hanger just a little reminder of um, some safe sleep cues. Yeah. Um, so then behind this door is his closet so we can show you his closet it like looks like a mess but it's not. <laughs> So up here we have excess diapers, uh, newborn ones, and I think it's just newborn and ones are here. And then we have his clothes, and we got these cute little like organizers, um, so you can separate the clothes by months. So the clothes that we have hanging up here are um, outfits that are put together, or um, like things that are just one piece. Um, and then behind it we have a whole bunch of bibs. We have holiday bibs. Um, we have. Our baby carrier, we did the Lilla baby. Um, and then we have clothes down here stacked up in bins that, um, that are like older clothes. We also have his high chair back here and um, his humidifier and his bath. And then this is his swing. So we just don't have his swing out yet, but he we will use it. We have his diaper pail. <laughs> Beautiful. And then this is going to be his whole changing area. So we're really excited with how this turned out. So. We started collecting these um, once the Christopher Robin movie came out in 2018. Um, and so we got Pooh and Piglet, very lucky to get them. We got Tigger last. And then we wanted to get a few more, but the only ones we can find was Kanga and Roo. Um, so we decided to just leave it with these three. And then of course our baby monitor is up here. Um, so we started out with some Winnie the Pooh um, linens which we love. We're so excited about like having like a little Winnie the Pooh themed uh, nursery for now. Um, you know, normal diaper stuff, except these diapers um, were written on from uh, my family during my uh, baby shower. So they're a size one. So they did like overnight diapers. Um, so a lot of my family and friends wrote like really cute, silly little notes on diapers for us. Um, we have some like toys and books up here, you know, wipes and lotions and whatever. Um, we'll show you briefly his drawers just so you can sort of see like what we have and how we organized. So these are all newborn diapers. Um, we have extra packs of wipes. We have buggy wipes. And then back here we have some of his hats, which we know he's not going to be wearing hats a lot because he'll probably just pull them off. Um, newborn and zero to three clothes and pants. So they're just onesies and um, pants that are in here. And then down here we have just plain white onesies, some swaddles, and some more bibs. We have a lot of bibs for him. <laughs> and then up here, we have some stuff that we're really going to need to access from his chair. Um, so we have some burp cloths and receiving blankets. His um, pajamas are up here. And then we also have his um, swaddles. So we're really going to go with like the zipper and Velcro swaddles. They're just easier. And then pacifiers. Down here, we have some sleep sacks, some older sized pajamas, and then some extra receiving blankets and burp cloths. And then this is sort of like our like catch-all drawer. So there's blankets, there's some extra books. Um, there's some, this is a hat that my aunt crocheted for him and we have booties with it. I crocheted this hat um, with some booties to match. And then just his little socks are down here as well. So this is probably my favorite area of the nursery. This chair is so comfortable. We got it from Bye Bye Baby and it's like a rocker and like a swivel and a glider and I just really like it. Um, and then above here we have some golden books. So we got these shelves from Target and we put like the really cool golden books up there. So we also have our baby monitor over here. It's just kind of hanging out here for now until um, we're going to need to use it. But um, we really like this one, so I'm not going to turn it on and like show you all the features of it. But it pairs with the camera that's up next to Tigger, and it does turn 360, and it like zooms in and out, and um, it'll show like the temperature of the room and everything. So that's really neat. And then our friend Katie also got us a hatch for him, 
so I'm really excited. I really like the hatch, and we've played around a lot on the app for it, and it's really, really neat. So this blanket, I also um, crocheted during uh, quarantine. So before we even were pregnant, um, I just had this thought of what I wanted this baby blanket to be like for a future baby. So that was that. And um, then we got this pillow as one of our gifts. So let me have his bookshelf. So he got tons and tons and tons of books for um, my baby shower at home. We did um, books instead of cards, and so they all have really nice little signatures and notes from family in it. So it's gonna be really nice to read that stuff to him and open it up and see who gave him the really cool books. The little basket next to it is gonna kind of be like a temporary hamper for now. We don't really have a hamper, so I know we're gonna need one, but the room with the way that it's situated, I don't really know where we can put one. So right now we have that basket. Over here, we'll briefly show you this chair because it has his name on it, but we've hidden it with a Grogu balloon that I got from my work baby shower. And then we have um, these stickers. So the reason we have the chair already is um, for his milestones. I'm going to sit him in the chair and then put the stickers there and we can take a picture with him. So I'm really excited for this. This is something I had like literally had a dream about and then we actually did it, so I'm really excited. And then over here is just another dresser area, but this is sort of Mitchell's kind of area, so of course everything is trains and elephants over here, but um, it's really cool Disney trains. So um, the Big Thunder Mountain Railroad, we have two of them up here, and then we also have the uh, Runaway Railway train. So this Donald, I don't know when we got him, but he's really cute, and he's just really soft. Um, and so we decided we just were going to keep him in our baby's room. So now he's just, this is his home right now. Um, this basket I also got from my baby shower for work, but we decided to put all of his like board books in it and they fit really nicely in it. Um, so we can read those to him, his little piggy bank my parents gave him. And this teddy bear is actually, um, he's got a special meaning behind it. Um, when we reveal the baby's name, we'll talk about this teddy bear a little bit more but I don't think anyone I don't think anyone knows the story I don't think so I don't think we've ever told we've it like never told that story. we've told it to friends and family but yeah. I don't think we've ever like said it beyond that no so I mean we this is my first ever Build-A-Bear that we got when we started dating so um it kind of his namesake yeah so it's really interesting <laughs> that our baby's namesake sort of comes from a Build-A-Bear um but anyway here we can show you these drawers these drawers are kind of like a lot of little things so we have um, some medical and then some bath stuff kind of we have washcloths and swaddles hooded towels his little uh, temperature rubber ducky is in here um, this drawer is going to be crib sheets and changing table sheets and a little memory box and then this drawer looks a whole hot mess I promise I know exactly what's in here <laughs> um, it's just kind of little toys and then um, sort of like to-go stuff that will be like in his diaper bag. And then this is um, netting for his stroller. So did we ever show off his stroller? I don't know if we have. Maybe we can show off his stroller. It's my favorite baby <laughs> item. Um, so yeah, this is all just like to-go stuff and like stuff that will probably transition to um, his diaper bag. But his diaper bag is his hospital bag right now. And then we have the baby's crib. The last part. Um, so we have the matching Winnie the Pooh sheets in here that go with the changing table. And then um, we have his crib on the highest setting now, of course, because he's an infant. But, um, or he will be an infant. But um, this will come down at five months or when he can push up. I know all this, the safe sleep rules, but it's really cute. I can play a little bit of this for you. Time to stop. It was. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, we're gonna have a bassinet in our room. We just don't have it set up yet. So for the meantime, it was kind of folded up over here in the corner. Um, but he's gonna sleep in our room until um, the whatever the regulations are in the bassinet that he can't sleep in there anymore. And then he'll be in here because we can't put anything bigger in our room because we we don't have the space <laughs> in our room. So he's probably gonna come into his crib a little sooner than what we would like. But that's okay. Everything's all set up and. We're just really excited. So I think we're going to show you guys our stroller now because I'm just really excited for it. So my absolute favorite, favorite, favorite baby item that I wanted for so long. 
I got an Uppa Baby stroller. I'm so excited with it. So we have the Uppa Baby Cruise V2. Um, we got it in the, I think the color is called Gregory. Um, right now we do have the uh, infant insert in it that we also got separately. So when we have the infant insert in it, you're not supposed to have this bar in it. So it won't be in it when he's here. But I'm um, just kind of showing you all the parts together. I love this stroller. It wheels so easily. It's my favorite. Um, we also got so many accessories for it. So we also have the, um, the parent organizer. We have when he um, is big enough to like kind of sit and have some snackies in it. We also got the snack tray that will replace uh, this bar. So I don't know, I'm just really excited. I love this stroller. Um, it's just, it's everything I've wanted. I'm really excited. We're gonna take a bunch of walks on it. And it's gonna be so fun. We're gonna take him to Disney in this stroller. And then we also have um, the bassinet that we have is the upper baby bassinet. So we can also just pop it right into here and then we're good to go. We also have the upper baby um, car seat. So we can also just pop that into here when he's really little and then we're good to go. So I'm just really excited with this. Um, I just had to show off my upper baby stroller because I love it so much. So that will wrap it up for our little bit of a nursery tour. You guys kind of got to see what we've done with the place and uh, some of the key features to it. Uh, yeah. You know, we're really happy with what we were able to accomplish in this room. Yeah. It's a really small room, um, but, you know, it's it, it's his room. Yeah. It's going to be his room for, for at least the next couple of months. So Yeah. We're, yeah. This is a rental house, and we could have painted the walls, but we kind of like the gray. It's not, like, the room isn't exactly like what we would have done to it, but... You know, it's just temporary for now, but um, you know, we made it ours, and yeah. I'm just really excited. Yeah, so obviously Amanda's favorite thing is, is a stroller. I think my favorite thing is the chair. And if you had to stick this room, it'd probably be the chair for you it too, right? It would be the chair. I love the chair. Any chance that we get to, like, <laughs> come in here and, like, organize or clean up something, we're typically fighting over who gets to sit in yeah. the chair because we, we love it. It's really comfortable, and it's from... Um, Bye Bye Baby. So all of his furniture is from Bye Bye Baby. It's the um, the uh, brand Da Vinci. So his crib is the Charlie. And then his dressers, there was like a weird thing with his dressers. So they didn't have like this long dresser. They didn't have it in the style that we, that matches his crib. And they wouldn't have gotten it until like this now. week. Yeah. Like now. Um, so that really stressed me out. I didn't want to be building or like not having his dresser organized or anything at like almost nine months pregnant. So we went with another style, but the same exact color, which we're really happy with. And then this topper is just like a, a basic like Da Vinci, just like topper. And it screws into uh, the dresser as well. So when he doesn't eat anymore, we can unscrew it and then it's just a normal dresser. Um, like I said, chair is bye bye baby. Um, his bookshelf is from Amazon. And then his his little chair is Pottery Barn Kids. So, I don't know. I'm really excited. Everything is really nice and just flows really nice. And it's like my favorite room. Yeah, just a couple more weeks and he'll be in this room. And yeah. Well, not necessarily in this room, but we'll be changing him in here. And, mm -hmm. you know, maybe a, a couple other little things. Yeah, maybe so. some little naps in here or something. Yeah. But I'm just really excited to just have him and hold him in here and just to start using the stuff that we got for him. Yeah. So we hope you guys enjoyed, and uh, thank you so much for watching this video. Hi everyone, thanks for joining us on this adventure. We hope you had as much fun watching it as we did making it. Make sure you subscribe here for more fun videos. And don't forget to check out the previous video, which is right here. Also, make sure you follow us on Instagram and Twitter, and any other social media we have, we'll put the links below for that. Thanks again for watching.